in the heart of the Andes Mountains. There lived a little llama named Luna. Luna was small for her age, but she had a heart full of dreams and a spirit as high as the mountain peaks. Every day, Luna would watch the other llamas climb the steep trails and carry heavy packs with ease. She admired their strength and wished she could be as strong and brave. But Luna's mother always told her, you are special just the way you are. One day, you'll find your own way to shine. One crisp morning, as the sun painted the mountains with golden light, Luna decided to go on an adventure. She trotted up the rocky path, her hooves clicking against the stones. The higher she climbed, the more beautiful the view became. She could see the entire valley spread out below, dotted with colorful flowers and sparkling streams. As Luna explored, she heard a faint sound. It was a soft, melodic tune carried by the wind. Curious, she followed the sound until she came to a hidden grove. In the middle of the grove was an old, wise condor named Carlos, who was playing a flute made of reeds. Luna watched in awe as Carlos played. The music was enchanting, and it made her feel like she could do anything. When Carlos finished, he looked up and saw Luna standing there with wide eyes. Hello, little one, Carlos said kindly. What brings you here? I was exploring Luna, replied shyly. Your music is beautiful. I wish I could play like that. Carlos smiled. Music comes from the heart. If you truly want to learn, I can teach you. Luna's eyes sparkled with excitement. Oh yes, please. For the next few weeks, Luna visited Carlos every day. He taught her how to carve a flute from bamboo and how to play different notes. Luna practiced diligently and slowly, she began to create melodies that filled the grove with joy. One evening, as Luna was playing her flute, a terrible storm rolled in. The wind howled and the rain poured down, making it difficult for the llamas to find their way back to the shelter. Luna's mother and the other llamas were struggling to guide the herd. Luna felt a pang of fear. But then she remembered the music Carlos had taught her. She took a deep breath and began to play a strong, steady tune. The music cut through the noise of the storm, reaching the ears of the lost llamas. One by one, they followed the sound of Luna's flute, finding their way back to safety. Luna's mother hugged her tightly, tears of pride in her eyes. You are our hero, Luna, she said. Your music saved us. From that day on, Luna was known not just for her size, but for her bravery and her beautiful music. She played her flute in the mountains, bringing joy and hope to all who heard her. And Luna learned that everyone has their own way to shine. I hope you enjoyed the story. Please do hit the like button, share and subscribe for more videos.
Thank you for watching.